Hi friends, I am Roshni Suryan of Grade 11 of Little Flower Public School, Muringur. Standing here to speak about the dependence on technology makes humanity less intelligent. Well, humans depend upon technology for each and everything. For example, from his house to his school, college, office, etc. There is not even a single place where technology is not used. There are advantages as well as disadvantages of technology. But according to my concern, there are more disadvantages because one of them is that it decreases human intelligence. Now, a question arises, how? The answer to this question is very simple. Earlier, we were stretched to find out answers by our own or from anywhere, either from our teachers, parents or from our books. But nowadays, Technology has changed everything. Because of the inventions of mobile phones and internet, we have become so lazy that we do not even try to find out answers by ourselves. We depend upon Google and internet to find out answers. Even for doing calculations, we use a calculator rather than doing those calculations by our own. There is a similarity between all these things. And that is, all these things has decreased our intelligence. We are not determined or curious to know any answer or to find any answers by ourselves. We are totally dependent upon technology. There are some more disadvantages like the excessive usage of mobile phones and other gadgets which give out radiation that can destroy a person's mind and other organs with time. You might have noticed when you get glasses, people often say that it is due to the excessive usage of mobile phones or watching TV. Why is it so? It is so because these gadgets give out radiation which are not good for your human eye and brain. And obviously, something which is not good for our brain affects our intelligence too. Our parents often blame us that we are not able to do good in our studies because of the excessive usage of mobile phones and other gadgets. It is because these gadgets have now become a center of attraction and they attract students especially. Spoil their future by making them busy most of the time. Young boys and young girls have now become inordinately addicted to these gadgets. They thoughtlessly and uselessly wasting most of the time on these gadgets. Wise people say, time well utilized is time well spent. The only way to solve this problem is to understand the difference between exploitation and overexploitation of technology. There is a very thin line between both these things. If you get to know the difference and if you understand the difference, then you can use technology as a boon. Thank you.